Hi everyone and welcome to Tosu Show. And today we're gonna play Super Mario RPG Legends of the Seven Stars. And yes, it's a retro game because I always wanted to do some kind of retro game. And here you can see Princess Peach getting abducted by Bowser as usual and she's screaming help and Mario's there. <laughs> Anyway, that is the first RPG that was ever done of a Super Mario game. If we don't... Um, yeah, it's uh, it's actually the first one, I think. I don't even think there was anything else that was done before that. And it was obviously done by... Squaresoft at the time. On... The Super Nintendo, the SNES. So the funny thing for me is that I never had the opportunity to really play this game at the time because in Europe it never came out. Um, so that's a fun story, I guess. <laughs> but now we're gonna play the game and I let a little bit uh, that introduction of the game showing up like all the different aspects of the game. You saw Super Mario but now you're seeing a new character named Malo. And then you will see other characters and as you can hear the music in the background is like very fun and very special. And for those who don't know the music was actually composed by Yoko Shimomura who is now, I guess, most likely famous for Kingdom Hearts, I assume. But she did also all the Mario and Luigi, I think. So here it is, we have our character Gino. Gino, the one that everybody wants on Super Smash Bros for some reason. So... Yeah. Well, I guess he is in the latest Super, Mario, uh, Super Smash Bros, but just as as those weird thing, I don't remember what the names that the scout stuff that gave you more power or whatever on the story mode. Like, I don't remember. It's been a very long time I didn't play the Super Smash Bros. Ultimate on Switch. So here's King Bowser. So that means that King Bowser is a playable character. So you can play with him too in the game, which is super fun. And yeah, it's not really a spoil because we actually mention him here, I guess. <laughs> Although they don't make you... They don't show it to you that you can play with him. They only show uh, Malo, Gino and Mario here. Each of them having a different style of attack, but maybe we're gonna see some of it. I doubt it. In less than an hour, I doubt that I'm gonna be able to get all of them. But at least I can show you how to play the game with Mario. Oh, I never did that part of the game. I never went into the the cloud or whatever it is. Well, they do show quite a lot of the game in this. <laughs> and it, show pri no, it shows Princess Peach. Well, Princess Toadstool. And here the castle where everything starts. And everything ends too, I guess. <laughs> And yes, there it is, Super Mario RPG, Legion of the Seven Stars. It was done in 1996 by a, a collaboration between Nintendo and Square, as you can see. So let's get started. So I'm playing this on emulation, as you can see. I'm playing it with business, and so far it works very well. And I'm playing using my Xbox controller, so A, B, X, and Y are actually the opposite of what you have on a Super Nintendo because I don't know if you realized it but Xbox decided to put A as the bottom yeah at, at the end so it's A then B then X and Y whereas if you play on a Nintendo it's B and A and Y and X 
and because of that I keep getting <laughs> um, annoyed on some of um, on some games like Final Fantasy X, uh, 12 2 when I played it and there were those cute those quick uh, quick time events I never knew like oh A is it A or is it B <laughs> anywho uh, let's continue here and I'm gonna name Mario under my name Tosa oh well Tos sorry not Tosa not Tot alright let's go Tos Alright, Peach getting kidnapped by Bowser and then it's time for Mario to show up and to save a day or at least that's what we think it should be, right? So we'll see. I love a scream here. Isn't it cool for at the time with 16 uh, bit sound? I love them personally because I'm from that era, right? I'm mostly from the era of the Super Nintendo, what we call the Super NES in the US, um, or SNES or whatever. So right now I cannot do much with, uh, with any of my um, Gameplay wise I cannot do much, I can just walk and as you can see it's more like a 3D kind of walking here. I can jump with B and that's about it. Oh! And we go into a fight. So you can see here the fight A, B, uh, X and Y you can do some action. So if I press X it's for item which I don't have any. B is for defend and can run or whatever, or defense and running. Y is to use a special attack, but it uses its. Um, as you can see, Mario has 20 out of 20 HP right now, and apparently I have up to 10 MP. And jump is using 3 out of those 10, so. The easiest thing to do is to attack, so let's attack this one. Oh! Alright! So I just attacked him, but I wanted to show you something. So basically you can uh, power up your attack by uh, doing an action exactly at the right time. And the right time here is when Mario is throwing his punch, you have to press A again. So let's do it this time. Alright, I did it correctly here. Right, second battle. So by the way, jumping on the enemy doesn't do anything, I think. If I remember properly, I don't think it does anything. Oh, I guess it depends on the enemy. So here you can see that it didn't do anything to that uh, terrapin. So far so good. You can see that it's a very straightforward RPG so far. Oh, they're attacking me. Oh, there's four of them. I don't know if you can protect yourself. I don't remember um, if you... If you do an action at the right time, I don't know if it protects you. I don't remember. Uh, I'll have to double check that. But anyway, the attack is only 1 HP, so it's nothing. You can see that right now, once again, I still cannot do anything. So what's going on here? Alright, I don't need to do that much. Oh! Oh, no, I cannot run. Yes, I can. So by pressing Y and walking, I can run. Uh-oh, what's that? I guess it's Princess Peach up there. <laughs> but you can see that 
everything here in that game is about the expression of the characters on their face. You can see that Mario will never say anything most of the time. Okay, Tutsuto. Don't let Bowser bruise you, Mario. Mario, uh, Br Bowser. Mario, prepare yourself for the great beyond. So here you will see. The, okay, you can see that I can attack Bowser or I can attack uh, King Link. King, King Link. I'm gonna attack King Link because the goal is that Bowser will be probably too strong for me to beat. So if I make him fall, that should be good. Tutstall. Mario, for shame! Him for the shame! What if we use one of our special attack? So let's do the jump. So just one quick thing. When you do something on that game, you have to press twice the same uh, button. Otherwise, it's not going to launch something. So for example, here, since I press A, it just came back, right? If I press right, now... Um, okay, let's do the special attack. Buzzer, what was that sound? N n no, it's a chain reaction. Hang on, King Clink. Ah! So it's funny. I don't know if you heard, but there were also that noise about the. As if like you succeeded into something, because on Super Mario, when you go, you know, open stuff, there's always like certain noise, uh, certain uh, sound effects being like available to you. Well, sound effects that just like play when <laughs> when you touch something or things like that. It was the same here. All right, let's look. Bowser, coming, Mario. Uh oh. <laughs> Did still fight, Mario? Fight! Bowser, they should finish you. No. He's throwing stuff at us. Throwing hammers. And now we are down too, the same way that Bowser is. Bowser, mwahaha! Did you think I was just gonna give her to ya? You're always in my way. This is it. I'm gonna take you out, Mario. Oh, Fogger, foiled again. And Mario can jump very high, so maybe we'll get it. Yep. Look at Vincent's Peach face. She she has a smile. I guess it's it's so funny. <laughs> Let's talk. Oh, Mario! You had me so worried. Let's get out of here. Uh, Shriek, Mario! I'm going to fall! Uh oh, what's going on? Oh, what is that star up there? Oh, did you see? They change it into multiple stars. Like, there's seven of them? Is that what it is? And there's that big. Um, terrifying sword that just went on top of the Bowser's tower. Super Mario RPG. And that's how the game starts. Yes, there are seven of these eight of them. Mm -hmm. I don't remember. And we got out of a tower and right back at Mario's house <laughs> which is named Pipe House it's funny when you look at that because that house really looks like what they did on Final Fantasy 7 um, the original game because as you know Final Fantasy 7 the way that they did it is the characters are in 3D but then the rest is uh, what we call a pre-calculated 2D here it's all pre-calculated 2D plus 2D uh, 
characters on top of it, but that move kind of like in a 3D way. Alright, let's continue. Toad. Hey, Mario! Lots of people use something called the door to go in and out of their houses. Anyway, I came by to pick up Toots Toad since she's a bit late. <laughs> I just need to jump. B. Uh, you can jump on the bed. So one thing that you need to know on that game is that there's always hidden... Um... Oh, that's how you sleep. <laughs> I just... Uh... Alright, Mario is waking up again. So you just turn on the, turn off the light and then he goes to sleep. But there's always like um, you'll have to jump quite a lot in this game because there's um, secrets. Like there's a lot of um, secrets in the games that you need to find. Oh, okay. So to run, let's not forget it's Y, so I can run and jump. X will show the menu. And you can see that right now Mario is at level 1 with 20 HP. Item, I have absolutely nothing. But as you can see, there's a waste basket. So it means that you have a limited amount of items that you can get in this game. And that's very important. It was extremely important to remember about that. Then you have a status. So Mario right now... Well, <laughs> right now he's like 20, 20, 20 nearly at everything. His defense is at zero, which is not good. Um, but my next level is in 16 uh, experience points. Special is on the jump right now. Oh, look at that. Stomp foes push Y just before it. So actually I can do better. And at level 3 apparently I learned a new technique. Equip, so actually you can equip stuff. You can see that here we can have an, a weapon, an armor and an accessory. And then special item must be like some items that shouldn't be within items because otherwise if you lose them, like you could break the game. And you can see that right now I have a total of 10 flowers max. And it's across all the characters I assume. Uh, I don't remember, we'll see that eventually. These coins and these frog coins, which are both different things. Let's start to talk. Hey, I thought the princess was here with you, Mario, so where is she? Mario, what's with the silent treatment? You're not telling me something. It's Bowser again, isn't it? Oh no, here we go again. Mario, would you please bring her back like you always do? <laughs> we really make fun of her. Always do. Toad, if you're tired, if you're tired, just turn off the fungi light for a snooze. Okay, that's the only thing that he says. Okay. So obviously that thing here is a save point. So like that you can save. So right now I'm gonna save here. Ah! And you see now I'm trying to do Y, but I move the Y to be the X because it's the Xbox controller, so the Y is actually the one at the top. I'll have to get used to that. Okay, here's the Mario pad and that's the world map. And we need to go back to the Bowser's keep, which is like the, the tower that we were earlier. So let's see what's gonna happen here. <laughs> I love the effects, like all those little um, face facial recognition, uh, facial uh, things, and all those little uh, movement. You, you saw that the sword was talking as well, like there were movement on it. Alt, who goes there? A trespasser. This castle now belongs to us, the Smithing Gang. It's our first step towards taking over this world. And if it weren't for noisy characters like you, we'll practically own this world. So let's see you deal with this. <laughs> oh, we completely destroyed the bridge. So we'll have to find another way to go over there. <laughs> Thank you.
Vista here. So if I go back here, I guess we can just see. All right. Let's go back to talk to Toad. Ah! Oh my god. I'll do that mistake every time, don't I? <laughs> okay, Toad's here. You see, you can jump on character's head. Okay, let's talk to Toad. Toad! You're back so soon! Did you forget something? No? What happened then? <laughs> I love how he showed that. The bridge to Bowser's Keeps is out now? Just wonderful. We must inform the Chancellor of Mushroom Kingdom at once. Let's go, Mario. Alright, let's go, Mario. I don't know where we're gonna go, but... Oh! Oops, excuse me. Uh oh? That bump on your head reduces your HP level. One of Mushroom Kingdom's famous items ought to perk you right up. Receive the mushroom. Do you know how to use uh, how to new, uh, Do you know how to use items? I have no idea. Of course I do. Let's do. I have no idea because I want to make sure that everybody like see all the all the general uh, tutorials. Bam! Then, please allow me. In order to use items, open up the menu screens. With it, you can check your statues and coin count. Push X to open it. Ah, they forced me to do it. Okay. This is the menu. Use this to equip or use items. Choose item. Then press A. This is your item list. Read about items here, so you can see that there's, a, there's something to tell you what that item is about. So here, mushroom recovers 30 HP. To use a mushroom, point here and push A. Behold, it moves to Mario. Push A again to use it, or push B to cancel. Give it a try. Ah, they forced me to use it. See? You recovered your HP. And that's how it's done. Now you can get a boost whenever you're feeling tired. Uh, no. Why did I rush back? I had something to tell you. <gasps> ah, remember. I came to warn you that Mushroom Way is swarming with monsters. I just barely made it back here in one piece. Mario, please do something. Perhaps I can help. Do you know about timed hits? Let's say no for the moment, even though I already talked to you about that. Okay, allow me to explain. First, we'll enter a battle. First, push A. Okay, let's fight a Goomba. Push A again to attack. Uh, wait a second. Hit A again here. Good timing. When successful, your attack changes and damage increases. Hit A prior to attack too. Okay. Oh, so I was protecting myself last time. Good timing. This can help you decrease the amount of damage done to you. It won't always work, though. Now, try a special strike. So why? Um, why? <laughs> and jump. Push Y here. Ah, uh, so last time I did activate the right version because you heard that. Da -da 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 -da. Your attack would be more powerful. Learn special skills as you gain experience. They are on the menu. 
read about them, okay? And then he, and there you are! Now at least you have a fighting chance against those monsters! Uh, no! Why did I rush back? I had something to tell you! That's right! We need to tell the Chancellor about Toonstall! I'll see you over at Mushroom Kingdom. Just in case, take these with you. Receive free mushrooms. Okay, cool. They give uh, some mushroom. Ah, oh, I'm only at 17. Okay, you can see that mushroom, there's three of them. <laughs> Each of them are using something. Oh, even my flowers were used. Um, Toad, you cheater. Now I'm obliged to go sleep. Okay, let's get going. And let's save so that, that we can skip all that stuff later on. So, by the way, I do have Super Mario RPG as a game on the Wii U. I bought the version that is like... Um, how do they name that already? I don't even remember how they name that. On the Nintendo eShop at the time, you had those um, emulation uh, style games that you can play on Wii U. I do have Super Mario RPG and I stopped it at the usual place that I keep stopping that game. It's been twice that I played this game and twice I stopped after a certain moment where you have to save a princess. And then after that, uh, I stop. <laughs> I don't know why, it's, it's unfortunate because that game is really good. It's really fun. It's not that hard as an RPG, to be honest. So if you want to get started with RPG, Super Mario RPG is a great example of one. So let's go to Mushroom Way and let's get started to actually do some real battle. Okay, I protect myself, I think. The, um, oh, I said the, I'm sorry. Um, so as you can see, I received two uh, experience points and a total of 16 to uh, actually get a, a, a level. Oh, HP max. So they heal me. That's good. So obviously it's the beginning of the game, so they are being very nice, right? So don't think that it's like that in the role game, it's not the case. Like this thing does not appear always, and it's not only HP max, sometimes it could be something very different. I don't know if I do it right or not, that's the thing, because I, I can't recognize when it's done right or not, so... Oh. Let's see, I'm gonna let myself be attacked um, in a normal way without touching my controller. I still don't know! <laughs> okay, we're getting closer to 11. Okay, let's... Uh... Oh, it's for coins, cool. Okay, let's fight. What's the name? Sky Trooper. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, this one gave us coin. One experience point and one coin. You will see that when you get to level, sometimes you will have to, to select some stuff. Okay, let's attack that Goomba. Okay, there's only two. 
that's good. Because I was kind of... Oh, okay, they gave me Vash Pimax, so... So I got healed, which is good. Toad. Phew! My life was flashing before my eyes for a second there. Here's a little something in return. Receive a honey syrup. Okay, let's see what honey syrup is about. So, honey syrup is re recovering 10 flower points. So it's funny because mushroom, basically, when you think about it, those are potions in a classic RPG. Well, in a classic, I guess in Final Fantasy. <laughs> and uh, effer for MPs, right? Oh. oh, look at that trickster, he tried to trick me. Yeah, sometimes it's not really certain when the key to stop something is. And you will see that each character obviously has their own, as well, they have their own um, attack style. So when you have to attack, will not necessarily be at the moment that you do it here. Oh shoot, I didn't. And now you have different kind of weapons too in the game. Oh, okay, we got a level up, level up bonus. Mario reaches level two. So you see that now my HP will be at 25, my attack 23, my defense at two, my magic attack 12, and my magic defense at four. Now I can get a bonus between HP, power, or star. Uh, since it's the beginning of the game, Usually when you're stronger is better, or when you have more HP is better, and then later on maybe the magic. I'm gonna do power. Oh, actually it's, it makes your attack and defense go up, that's good. This is just HP and this, oh, actually it's pretty good too. Like the magic attack goes very high thanks to that. Higher than this, but I need the defense for the moment, so let's do the power. Ugh. Because for the moment, there's not that much thing you can do with a current... Uh... Okay, I'm obliged to use that thing actually... Oh! <laughs> yeah, the music from Yokoshi Momura is great in this game. I really like it. Um, so if we go back here, let's look at our statues for a minute. So my next level will be at 30, and currently we... Um, I don't know if it's 30 or if it's the difference between the 30 and 18 here. Let's see. We're gonna know pretty soon. Okay. Ah. Uh. So it should be at 28 if it's what I think it should be. Oh. <laughs> um. Okay. Ah, I keep me. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. It's just I'm not used to. To this. Oh. I guess this would have. Um, Oh, it gave me one new flower, so now I have 11 in terms of magic. Interesting. Oh, I was wondering what would be here because I couldn't see anything. It was a trick. Ah, oh, it was a trap, not a trick. <laughs> Sorry. I would say that sometimes, unfortunately, I use the wrong words. Sometimes I have to think a little bit too much about what kind of words I'm supposed to use. Okay, free experience point. There must be something. Mm -hmm. 
Let's save Toad. Oh, cool. Now we can beat him in one strike. Toad. Boy, that was a close call. Here's a token of my appreciation. Here's a token of my appreciation. Receive the flower tab. Okay, what is a flower tab? <laughs> Let's look at that. West raise flower point by one. I mean, why not using it now? Yay! I got 12. And plus, it's actually heal you 100% uh, of your of your MP. So I should consider that in the future. So here's the thing that is interesting: is that you don't necessarily know where to go in those 3D. When you have 3D like this, no, no, to really know where to go, you have to make sure that there's always some. Oh, what was that? I guess we have a secret Goomba that was hidden there. Oh, what was that? I guess it's um, this would have helped me get all my HP back. Okay, my next level is in uh, 22. I'm curious, if I go back to the previous uh, place, okay, there's no no enemies here. I'm curious about something else, if I completely get out and come back in, what's gonna happen? All the enemies come back, which makes complete sense, but just wanted to make sure. And that's how you can make, uh, you can train your character here. But for the sake of going fast, I'm not going to train my character. I'm just going to beat like all the enemies that I see here, but I'm not going to train my character. Because I want to make sure that you can see a little bit more stuff, like going to a city, to the city for example, would be a good thing. Oh. Here's another attack. That's new. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, wow. He didn't attack. Oh, lucky. What I like with them is that obviously they give money, whereas the Goomba doesn't give anything. But they're Goomba after all. I mean, you all know Goomba from. A Super Mario game, they are the least, <laughs> the least stronger of the enemies. And sorry, I was not thinking. Uh, the least strong, I guess we should say, not the least stronger. The weakest, the weaker type of enemy, the weakest, whatever you want to say. But now they don't give HP max anymore. <laughs> Uh, it would be interesting to see if some of those uh, treasure will come back or not. But yeah, compared to more recent game, like oh. I don't know when is the right frame to protect yourself here. So one game that does that quite a lot too is Mother 3. So I don't know if you ever play Mother 3. Mother 3 is on uh, Game Boy Advance and it's probably a game that I'm going to do a game preview as well. Eventually. But what's happening on Mother 3 is that you cannot... Um, In Mother 3, you have to actually really use the rhythm system of the game. 
in order to do good attacks. And if you play on an emulation, it's much, much harder because sometimes it doesn't work as expected. But unfortunately, Mother 3 came out only in Japan, so if you really want to play it, you either have to play it in Japanese or you have to emulate it or find a way to to get your emulation working. Yeah, level 3! I wasn't expecting that, but you can see that my attack and defense goes pretty high right now and I learned fire ops, so let's see. If I do that, if I do that. Hmm. See, it's funny because I guess what I should have done is the star first because I, I have the impression it gave quite a lot, now it gave much less, but here the attack and defense get more than the rest. Anyway. tend to forget sometimes that you have to double attack. Um. So he leaves back for this. Okay. We'll be able to see what he does. Because I'm at 20. Ah, oh, I'm at 28. So let's see, I'm at 28. Yep, that's what I thought. So it's it's uh, healing us 100%. Hmm, this one is weird. Why is it located here? Okay. There must be some secret that I'm not thinking about. Okay, let's attack that thing. Oh, they give mushroom. Good. Two experience points and three coins. Okay. I like that. I don't know when I need to protect myself against that, but anyway, let's see if it's still true. Do they still give mushroom? Ooh, they are good enemies. <laughs> But then I would have far too many mushrooms. But they give coins too, which is good. Oh, they don't give mushroom every time. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Ah! Oh. I need to fight that guy before it... I, I forgot his name. Is that cool? No. I forgot the name of uh, Lucky Two. Is that Lucky Two? Yeah, I think it is. I think it's Lucky Two. Oh, what was that? I didn't even, even realize that there were one. <laughs> Yay, yeah, attack up. So you see, like I told you, it's not always HP up, it could be something else. Okay, let's fight Lucky too. Oh! I thought that it would be Lucky too. I thought that I touched it. Maybe not. Ooh, what was that? 
can see that it was emulation, obviously. Oh, I cannot attack him? No way. There must be a way to attack him, right? Uh oh. Hey! Are you looking at me? My armor and I don't like you! Mario! You better be careful! He's definitely got a mean streak! I'm coming. I'm just trying to see if there's a way to beat that lucky two that keeps throwing stuff. I guess not. But I'm wondering if it did that on purpose because they know that you need mushroom and and stuff to, to heal yourself before that battle. Lucky! I don't remember what Lucky does. I think that... Let's see. Oh. WX points. Challenge the system. Win big or lose it all. Okay, I'll do it. Where's Yoshi? So it was in the center. Oh! I think he's back in the center. Oh, Ty! That went so fast! So I keep the same amount. <laughs> okay, that's good. At least they allow me to get the same amount and not. Okay, let's see. Okay, let's use a mushroom. Alright, let's go. Let's fight the boss. Now you got my hammer hungry. You shouldn't have done that. Is there only one or two? Yeah, there's two, obviously. Alright. Let's play a little bit with the special stuff. Oh, cool. Let's do the fire... Well, I didn't check the fire orb or how it works exactly. I should have, but... Let's do it. Okay, I press... Uh, hit Y repeatedly. I don't know if I could protect myself against that. Yes! Okay, they are pretty easy to beat. Battle up! So he's gonna have better attack. I have to be careful about that. Oh, battle up is protecting him better. Okay. I don't think I can protect myself against that. Ah, that's an easy boss. <laughs> but that's the beginning of the game at the same time. And it's a Super Mario that was done as an RPG game, so I'm sure they didn't want to make it too hard. Toad. Thanks, Mario. I was running so fast, I wasn't watching where I was going. Mushroom Kingdom's just ahead. We're almost there, Mario. Hey, where did this hammer come from? Hmm. Hey, do you know what this is? It has the Armor Bros insignia on it. No one stood a chance against you when you warm them with this. A weapon. Yeah, you never know, it might come in handy. Picked up a hammer. Let's get a move on. I'll see you in Mushroom Kingdom. Okay, let's equip it. So if I go to equip, weapon. Oh wow, from 29 to 39. What did it say? Pawns in me, okay. And on special, let's look at Fire Hub. Oh, they, they heal my flowers can't. Good. Fire up. Push Y repeatedly. Okay. And in statues, I have a flower jar to raise. Oh, wow. By three. That's a big jump. I'm gonna use that afterwards. Oh, X and Y. I keep doing the wrong thing. Lucky to come on here. I guess I cannot do anything against Lucky too. Oh well. Let's see if enemies came back so like that I can actually try the hammer. 
And that's where we're gonna call it a date for today. Um, and nobody's back. Alright. Um, it's time to go. Alright. Uh, one more fight and then I'm done. Okay, let's attack with the hammer and see the difference. Okay, I attack at the right time. And let's finish this battle and then we're gonna go... Oh, I missed it. Alright. Let's try one more time super quickly. Okay, it's before it goes down. I think. Okay, yep, that's correct. Alright, cool. Well, we're gonna stop here. Thank you so much for watching Tosu Show. I hope you appreciated that I did a retro game, Super Mario RPG, The Legend of, Seven St of the Seven Stars. It's a great game, it's a great RPG. I really suggest people to play it if you can because it's really fun it's really simple and straightforward and now you can understand why people talk about Gino so much I guess too <laughs> all right everybody talk to you soon and hope you can you will subscribe to my channel and follow my Facebook page bye bye